The biggest fight in the world, the fight of the century, right, is finally here. Recently, sports artist Dave Hobrek was commissioned by Mayweather Promotions to create an outstanding 12-foot by 4-foot painting for Floyd. Here with us now is the incredible work, uh, the artist himself. We have Dave here. Welcome to the show. Thank you for having me. Yeah, Hello. We're, just, we're standing here. Mimi and I were just like, whoa, this is blowing us away. How did you get the opportunity to, to paint this? This is huge. Uh, yeah, it's a giant piece. Um, I'm a sports artist. I do a charcoal pastel paintings okay. all in black and white um, a while ago I did a piece with Oscar de la Hoya uh. and through Golden Boy and then they were nice enough to send my information to Mayweather uh -huh. and Mayweather promotions and we just started talking and kind of put a deal together and it's been a kind of a long road on getting here and mm. it's finally here and I got to paint it so and you got to exciting paint it. Yeah. what materials did you use no you're good what materials did you use to put this together so it's um, it's charcoal and pastel. Uh -huh. It's grinded up into dust, then mixed together, and then it's all brush applied, and then taken back off with different erasers. That's but great. then the cool thing about it too is inside they're hidden. Um, here's parts. Um, for example, here's a wrap, hand wrap from Floyd. He sent us this. This is a real one. Yeah, it's a real one. Wow, so what I did was a hand wrap. We have speed bags, heavy bags, yeah. jump rope, um, ring mats, the corners, everything. I would cut them up, uh -huh. and then I ended up putting them into the painting. You did. So height, like right here, is a little bit of a speed bag. And if you look close, like to right here, um, this is like a hand wrap here, and then I cut a hand wrap up, put it in there, kind of blended it and painted it over. Yeah. And you have like heavy bags. Um, the so ring 3D, here. I can see it's popping yeah. out in some You can spots. kind of see it now. Here's a corner And this is going to be on display at MGM Grand this weekend? It is. It's on display there. It's uh, at a couple of spots. So um, it's at the Maypack store over at Fremont and Las Vegas Boulevard. So we have some a display over there selling okay. our other um, prints. And then it's at the MGM Grand at the Grand and Company. Nice. And then, uh, let's see, Thursday, um, we're at the fight night at Caesars. Of pool. course. And then Friday is the Nevada Boxing Hall of Fame. So we'll be doing that and then donating a, uh, a portion of the proceeds to their um, organization. Awesome. How and do you back to this? It's crazy. You're, you're, <laughs> yeah, <laughs> yeah, there's a bunch of us and then your, your crew has been helping out big yeah. time because it's, yeah, it's a little... A little wobbly. Yeah, yeah it's How a monster long did piece. It, take you? it took me actually 650 hours, Ooh. so a few months. You know, wow. I yeah, I kept going on it, and usually my pieces are like I'm like 30 by 50, so yeah. doing something like this was giant. And yeah. So I kind of had to take my time, make sure everything was right. And, and what's the value? Um, this piece here we're selling for 150 grand, mm -hmm. and then we also have the different size prints. So not for the original, we have yeah. prints that are from hundred dollars. We have a $500 one, a $1,000 one, and then even a $10,000 print. So you have like a range for everybody for yeah. different How size walls. How can people get a hold of that? Um, you could go to all the different spots, like I said, mm -hmm. um, hobrecht.com. Um, it's on Mayweather Promotions and a couple other spots. So all the different places. And we're going to be here, um, started a few days ago, and we're going to be here all the way through the 4th. That is incredible. And what's been Floyd's reaction, his camp's reaction to all of this? They love it. They love it. I, <laughs> Floyd hasn't seen the painting painting itself. I know I've had to show them different things and like progress reports and that stuff. Yeah. And then he, they picked out some of the fighters I had to put in there and, and the end piece on the end where he's getting out of the... The, um, the car. So I know there's been, mm. he's seen it, but not the big piece yeah. yet. So I'm looking forward to hearing. And you've worked with other big A-listers, correct? Yeah. Who yeah. else? Um, we got a great opportunity to work with Derek Jeter this year for his wow. final nice. season. And we did a print series with him through uh, Steiner Sports, which was great. People from like Tony Hawk, Willie Mays was one of my favorites. Um, like a bunch of athletes. And there's a bunch of paintings that are non-athletic like stars and right. whatnot as well. Well, maybe he'll do Duck Dynasty one day. You never know. The yeah. Duck Commander yeah. crew. That'd be, that'd be great. That'd be great. All right. Yeah. I'm yeah. just hearing, you know, making stories <laughs> up. You can see Dave's one-of-a-kind work of art at MGM Grant all fight week long. This original 12-foot by 4-foot piece will be on display through May 3rd, like he mentioned. Several canvas prints will be available for purchase as well. For more on Hobrex Sports Art, visit the website or call the number right there on your screen. They were also on Facebook and Twitter, of course. Who isn't social? Still to come right here on Valley View Live, reggae music at its finest. Morgan Heritage takes on our stage with a live performance. And next, has singer Jessica Simpson.